Hey everybody, I had a stop over here at the uh, Lake Forest Oasis because something was rattling back there. It drove me nuts. Oh, it drove me nuts. I can't figure out what it is. needed to get some coffee and a little snack anyway so I don't know what the what the heck is uh, making that noise back there it is just incredible of, uh, man I tell you It was more than I could bear, I tell you. I, I just had to pull over. Anyway, on the positive note is... We are loaded. Weather is good. Traffic is good. Baby Blue doing just fine. Yeah, there it is again. driving for a couple hundred miles with that thing. Oh, man. I had to get me some earplugs. major construction going on downtown Chicago I think we better stick with the 294 let's take the bypass to drive down the road. Actually, I, I know some drivers that do it.
gotta pay storage for our all junk. that I kind of found out today was uh, if you type in JBG travels like 01 or 02, 03 you can actually go as far back as the uh, the oldest videos the problem is I uh, I have several 04s because I don't know I think I think I started over, what, the third time now? So it's... Go ahead and try that one. Uh, zero 01 or zero 02. You can also type in... Um, the White Beast. It was a Freightliner uh, Columbia. Oh man, listen to that. The sound of not music. this year in November I guess it's next year 2000 before 2017 right or is it 
before the end of 2017. Now I'm confused. <laughs> you know, the president, the, the new president in the Philippines, is a guy named uh, Rodrigo Duterte. Oh, he's uh, he's one tough cookie, I tell you. Uh, countless of drug dealers and pushers have already been killed. At least ten top brass police officers, commanders, chief and captains and all that stuff. Uh, they're, they've been fired and possibly jail time. Now you can't clean up crimes without taking shortcuts. I mean it just without bending laws or even up to breaking the law. But I tell you what, the people in the Philippines are so fed up with corruption and crimes and drug pushers and especially government corruptions that they're willing to they're willing to let him break all the laws he wants, clean up the uh, mess. I guess there's a point where democracy doesn't work anymore, you know? Somebody has to step up and be a, a dictator. You know, the word dictator, I don't think necessarily means bad. It's just somebody who's got the ultimate power that dictates. with dictators is well power corrupts absolute power corrupts absolutely but dictatorship to the right person I think is actually better than democracy Anyway, it's supposedly he vows to clean up the crime in the Philippines for within six months. Now, I'm not, he's not talking about absolute no crime at all, but he's, he's talking about the major stuff. I think they actually have a, a billion one billion peso bounty for the president's head. All the drug pushers and dealers got together, put up the uh, the money, and uh, whoever can kill the president will be making a billion peso. How much is a billion peso? Well, divide it by uh, about 42. One US dollar is 42 pesos. That's still quite a money, man. Interesting to see. Catch you guys later. Thanks for watching. Have a good and godly evening, everyone. Peace.